What's going on guys, Stalker back again, hope you're fantastic today and welcome to a really cool FNAF fan game called Michael's Adventure. Now this was recommended to me by a good friend called Rexdan, make sure you check him out. Now this looks like a type of fan game that I really like, very story driven, very niche, where it's more like a FNAF 4 minigame story. This one's focused on Michael Afton, which is really cool. It's short but sweet apparently, there is some swearing and stuff in this guys, I won't read it but you know the text will be some, some language so just a warning. Let's get straight into it, guys. Hopefully, you enjoyed today's video. I love you all. Let's do this. Oh, so, so, uh, Afton family. Michael was happy with the family he had. Yeah, this is the Afton family. Hey, there's William Elizabeth, fight victim Michael, and the wife. But his family wasn't always happy. The house was filled with screams and fights. Yeah, the wife's in black and white. One night, his mother left. Michael didn't know why she left. Ah, Why would she leave? Was it something that he did? His father stayed with them. He seemed happier when they were all together. Ah, One day Michael arrived early from school. Hello? Is there anyone home? Oh, purple guy! <laughs> oh no! I really like how it's set in like a TV screen as well. I love games like that. Dot, dot, dot. I think there's nobody home. I'll check the house just in case. So Michael's arrived from school early. So, father says he will appear in the telly someday. Okay. Our sofa is all sticky. I should stop saving my bubblegum there. Yeah, Michael. Father never allows us to sit here. This is his sofa. Interesting. So I guess we're just going to explore the house. Oh, my God. It's the bike victim's room. Hey. Oh. Okay. He's not here yet. Oh, oh my God. Look, the plushies. These are his friends. Interestingly, the foxy plushie still has his head. My favourite, Foxy the Pirate. Maybe I can borrow it without him noticing. He's always reading or writing. Such a nerd. Bonnie and Chica are always together. Father says I should order my clothes like him. It's just not my thing. I like them on the floor. <laughs> so it looks like Bite Victim's very organised and, you know, a good kid. How can he make the bed before going to school? I swear to God, this kid's so weird. So yeah, he's like a goody two-shoes kid. That's probably why Michael's jealous of him. Elizabeth's room. Father didn't pick her up yet. Let's have a look in Elizabeth's room. Father still makes her bed. Uh, father's going to scold her. She left her lamp on. Oh, what's this box? I don't even know what's inside of this girly thing. And I don't want to know. Yeah, it looks like the FNAF 4 box, <laughs> doesn't it? Father made it for her. I've never got a painting from him. Okay, that's interesting. Like showing that William cares a lot for Elizabeth. And then, unfortunately, Elizabeth gets killed by baby. Let's go in here. Hello? Oh, God. That sounds like Fredbear. Like Fredbear's laugh. What are those noises? Doesn't it? Yeah, that's definitely Fredbear's laugh. It's weird to see the sink dirty. Oh, why are there so many bottles yet? Yeah, William Afton's alcohol. Oh, no. And the table's not been cleaned either. Father usually cleans everything. So it looks like after William's wife has left, he's, he's gone a bit crazy. So what is this laughter about? That's my room, but the noises aren't coming from there. Oh. Is this like the basement? Or oh, William's room? William's bedroom? Is that... Father? Why is he crying? Oh, okay. That's interesting. Because in the games, it sounds like laughter. But this fan game say no. That's actually William Afton crying. Michael had never heard him cry before. Why would such a strong man like his father... Hide to cry. Hecking B. <laughs> God damn it. 
I gave her a lovely home, a beautiful life, and she still ungrateful be. Oh God, he's getting angry. He's throwing bottles. Michael's not happy. My Michael's scared. Was it because I'm not good enough? Or was it because I deserved it somehow? Either way, she never loved me. His heart sank inside his chest. His father was the most powerful man he knew. And it hurt to see him like this. So unlike him. Even if he was strict, Michael wanted his father to be okay. Why? Why with another man? I just... I can't take him believe they aren't mine. Only Michael is mine. Oh. That's deep, man. Michael was a kid, but he wasn't stupid. Mother cheated on him. Oh, damn. So this is like the origins of William. Still not an excuse to kill kids, to be honest. But like, this is like the, this fan game saying like, this is the origins of William's anger. Um, this is pretty deep, guys. It doesn't make sense. Stop. Nothing should make sense. Why would mother do such a thing? Especially to father. He's a good man. You'll get used to contradictions, Michael. Oh. <gasps> William! Things don't have to make sense to be real. Oh my god, that is creepy. They will never end up making sense. Oh. <gasps> but still, Michael couldn't open that door. Oh, damn. <gasps> he couldn't find the courage to open it. It hurts. So yeah, Michael ran away. Damn. Nothing was fair. It was like his whole life fell apart. Oh. He knew he was alone. Shut up. <laughs> Crying won't solve anything. Instead of acting like a girl, focus on fixing your hecking problems. Michael would usually keep quiet. It was never fair. His father cried when nobody was looking. Why was it different when Michael did it? Father had good reasons to cry. Michael's were childish, right? <laughs> Heck, your brother is also crying. Michael, you're, you're already 10 years old. Be a man for once. So the bite victim was crying too. We know that from FNAF 4, crying child. Come here, little man. What's wrong? Oh, oh, it's the Fredbear plushie. And that's a bite victim. Here, this plushie will protect you from bad thoughts. Take care of it, okay? Okay. Hello, Michael. Oh, no. Is Michael jealous or something? Oh! Of course. 
Oh, is Michael's like, it's all his fault. Who else is? He's blaming the bike victim. He's blaming his brother. Oh, will you bring your foxy plushie at school? What about Fredbear? I thought you liked it. Oh, okay. Have fun at school today. What about you, Liz? Are you prepared to go? Of course, Daddy. And nothing for Michael, of course. Things being as normal as possible. Ah, okay. I'll make you heck yourself at school. You hear me? He's talking to the pride child here. I'll make you regret you were even born. See you soon, little man. Uh, yeah, it looks like Michael's jealous of his younger brother because he's not getting any attention from his dad. Oh, here we go. It's time to find that mother hecker. Why is it still like phone guy? Hey, Mikey, Mikey. What do you think about my new boyfriend? Stop calling me Mikey. Oh, why, Mikey? I know you're trying to make me jealous, but it's not going to work, Rosie. No, it's not like that. And leave me alone. Yeah, Michael seems to be very miserable at the moment. Oh, hey, Mike. I've been waiting for you. Hey, uh, Jamie. Have you seen my little brother? Oh, I think I saw him outside. Cool. Oh, look, he's following me. Sup, Mike. Jamie. Hey, David. David, Mike is looking for his little brother. Why? Well, I have something in mind. Okay. Oh, we're going to bully him. These are the bullies. Oh, hi, Mike, David, Jamie. What's up, Rod? These, uh, these heck wipes didn't do my homework yet. Anyways, let's do something fun. Everything's fun around you guys. Heh, we're going to have a lot of fun today. Don't worry. Oh, really? Heck yes. Yep, we're the bullies, guys. We are the bullies. We're going outside. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, this is it. I hope you enjoyed this little thing. Oh, okay. That was interesting. Nice little, like, origins of uh, Michael and stuff. I hope they expand upon this. I'd say this is more like a demo of Michael's adventure because that's the origins of Michael bullying his little brother, the crying child, which eventually leads up to the bite, right? The the crying child getting bit by Fredbear. I know this is a fan game, but I liked how it had a little bit of an origin to it. More of a reason why Michael was bullying his younger brother, jealousy, and William Afton caring more about the crying child and taking care of him, giving him a Fredbear plushie. I feel like there was a lot of swearing, though. I don't think the, I don't think there needed to be that much swearing, to be honest. It was very unique, and I liked it. And I liked how William Afton was, like, the really creepy purple guy. And I do feel like, because of security breach and stuff, that finally we're getting some more origins behind William's motive, you know, uh, with the therapy sessions talking about a man called Bill, how William and his wife had a divorce... But William got custody of the kids. Um, you know, stuff like that, showing William's motive and stuff and manipulation is nice to see finally in the canon game. So let me know your thoughts about this as well in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Take care and I'll see you all next time.